So guys, so out here I have a Marine 6BT. Um, this, uh, this engine recently had its fuel filters changed and uh, after changing the fuel filters and starting the engine, the engine died approximately 30 seconds after running. And what happened was it drained out the fuel from that secondary filter. Um, first of all, you always want to take the precautions to uh, attempt to prevent that from happening or pre prevent the engine from becoming airbound completely. But sometimes that's not always the case. Sometimes it will become airbound. And um, all you have to do then is just purge the fuel system. And what you'll want to do is you'll want to loosen each one of these injector hoses. There's six of them. And uh, you'll give them about a quarter turn, maybe a half turn. And uh, you'll want to turn the engine over. And you'll see fuel start to spill from the head of each one of these injectors. There's one there. There's one there. Sorry. One there. One there. And it's not an excessive amount of fuel. It's, it's very small. And, um... Typically on a boat, you're gonna have off-road diesel in here, so it's gonna be a bright red uh, tint to it. And you'll wanna see that coming from every single one of them. It's best to have a good hot battery for something like this. You want the engine turning over pretty quick usually. At least I find that it helps. And uh, once, you, once you turn it over, you'll wanna go ahead and tighten down those uh, injectors once more and turn it over, and it may not start immediately. Um, if it doesn't start after that, uh, after turning it over for a little bit, you'll want to crack those injectors once again and you may see some bubbles popping out of them along with some red fuel because there may be pressure on these lines after you just turn it off. So you'll crack these loose just a little bit and you may see some red fuel come out with some little bubbles. That's a good sign. You want that air out of there. You'll turn it over again once more. Get a little bit more red fuel coming out of the edges. The inside edges right here, you'll see it. You have the fitting and the hose it'll be coming from right in there and uh then once more tighten them down try to start it up again and uh that should start it right up like i said a good hot battery helps and uh, that'll purge your fuel system thanks